Hello everyone. Uh, in this video today, we will see how e-signatures can be embedded in ERP application. Uh, there are multiple vendors providing e-signature functionality like Adobe Sign or DocuSign, uh, the famous ones. Uh, these apps help users to create PDF out of the forms or Word documents and approvals and notifications are built in as well. In this POC, business case is to have a different application out of the ERP. Uh, where employees can fill in a form and submit them for approvals. Our ERP application here is PeopleSoft. Uh, PeopleSoft is one of the most flexible and powerful ERP technology-wise out there. You can spin up a REST integration in a short amount of time. PeopleSoft is exposing data via REST API. PeopleSoft database can also be used, uh, which will make things a bit easier. Depending on your business requirement, you might or might not want to share data at database level. Here we are sharing data after applying business rules at the application level. What that helps us is we can apply appropriate business rules before the data goes out. This way you can also expose your business rules, your security like roles and permission, instead of creating them again in your custom application. Uh, so we can see uh, this page in PeopleSoft. Uh, I have accumulated all the information related to my functionality like employee ID, supervisor in a single page via views. These are being exposed via REST API. In PeopleSoft, component can generate APIs uh, based on their structure. This simplifies the creation of REST uh, based applications. So this is our current uh, custom application. Uh, the front end is in Angular, back end is Node.js running Express and MySQL is the database here. We have also enabled SSO via Google Firebase. Once a user log in with say their Google ID, the app will hit PeopleSoft and establishes user's identification by matching up the employee with the email ID. Uh, this can work with any other authentication provider as well, or even SMS. So we can see here data is kept in sync with PeopleSoft via REST service. Third-party applications don't have to store employer-related information, so authorization in one way is controlled via your ERP system. For this POC, the use case is very simple. Users are filling up a simple uh, form for IT products, and depending on the amount, we have established a rule. That is, if amount is more than 2,000, HOD approval is required. Again, these business rules can reside in your main ERP, so business configurations can uh, lie at central location. Uh, once we submit the form, the application will call Adobe's REST APIs to create a PDF form and then send it out for approval. There are multiple ways in Adobe to get approval done. Uh, you can do it within your application by embedding it or uh, send it to an email. Uh, here we have configured email approvals. So user will receive an email to approve the form as we can see here. Uh, user can click on the link to approve the form and this will open the main PDF form. <laughs> Here the form's look and feel is very modest, uh, but you can add logos, header and footer, or you can create your templates uh, to make it an eye candy. Okay, so trying to adjust the page so that approval button is visible, right. Uh, you can add your pre-saved signature or just type in your name and that will approve the forms. Again, you can have multiple level of approvals, uh, you can send out notifications. So all those things are available here. Okay. Uh, from our custom application, we can also see the status of our form, whether it has been approved, whether it has been out for delivery or not. Thanks to Adobe for letting the developers use their platform to create use cases to present them to business users. Please drop in a line in case of any queries or comments. Hope you like the video. Thanks for watching.